Hey. Hi. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, it's Nikki Young and Malia, and we're back for day 20 to talk about um spring. No. Love. No. Belize. What? <laughs> Yes, today we are going to talk about beliefs. What beliefs? We go answer that in a minute, real quick. Before my phone die, we go, um. Cause her talk to her friend. Stop telling my business. <laughs> my ghost, I think, I think about your business. Okay, so the verse for the day is, Now all has been heard. Here is the, conclu the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep his commandments. For this is the duty of all mankind. Oh my God. <laughs> this, guy, this girl here. It's crazy. So, <laughs> yeah. at least she knows. Um, so today's topic, beliefs. Before I get started, I'm probably going to make some people gasp, like, oh, how dare you say that? And say drum mill. Drum. <laughs> but. Say drum mill. Drum roll. But I dare you to just open your mind a little bit. And just think about it. Don't just get in your feelings and just because Mama, what's this? you heard something all your life, huh. something else can't be, you know. What's this? It's shea butter. Oh, I put shea butter on me. Go ahead. Get down. And don't use all my shea butter. Okay. <sighs> I tell you. That's enough. Uh uh. No. That does smell like flowers. It's lavender. She always distracted me, y'all. I'm sorry. She know I be trying to record and talk to y'all. Then she come in here asking me questions and messing with stuff. Okay. Um. Beliefs. Okay, so I'm going to start off by saying I believe that Jehovah is a woman. Stop saying that. <laughs> Did I just make somebody mad by saying our Lord and Savior Jesus? Well, not Jesus, but our God. Okay. It's a woman. I really do feel it. Because everything, everything is related to a woman. Mother Nature, the universe, like, even the weather is just relatable to a woman. Even God's wrath. It's, it's more, when you think about God's wrath, you think about an angry woman than you do an angry man. So, it just, I know God is an entity, so she can be whatever, a man or a female. Oh. But I believe she takes on the form of a woman the most. Ooh, this could be the even bigger gas. I think Lucifer is her sister. That's why she was held at the highest rank, like among the angels and stuff. I think it's her sister. And, um, 
because Lucifer also take on the form as a a woman the most when tempting somebody and stuff like that. Um, <laughs> this is going to sound crazy. Maybe it is. Maybe it ain't. Who knows? None of us was here in the beginning to actually know how it happened, but this is just my beliefs. But I feel... You know how it is in a classic story. You got the good sister, and then you got the other sister that just is like, think the other sister just thinks she's so much better. And so that, because of that, she becomes like the villain. And I think that's what, what happened with Lucifer. She felt God was so much better that she became Evil. jealous. And that's why jealousy is a sin. She became jealous and, and tried to turn. Wah, ha, 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 like that. Yeah. Her make wah, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> yeah, she became jealous and evil and tried to turn. A bite of stone. The angels um, against God. And, and that's when God cast yes. her mm -hmm. and the angels out of heaven. Um, but then, but then. Because she could have killed them, but she didn't because that's her sister, and you love her. And even though she tried to destroy you or you just can't bring yourself to do anything bad to your your sibling. So she just cast her away so that she can never come back into heaven. Um... I believe also that's why in Revelation she is going to give her another chance to repent and say she's sorry. Because even the devil gets one last chance to repent. Maybe the devil is a girl. That's what I just said. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Maybe God is a girl? I said that too. Oh, sorry. Okay, so... I believe, um, he, her trying to take us, God, after, girl, God was betrayed by her sister, she went out to, uh, me. Me make up. her the perfect, um, helpmate, the human, and, But the only downfall for that was humans, they flesh is real weak. And, and he was getting lonely. Yes, God was there for but, him. But, but he could never see him because it would make you go blind. To see God's glory. So, could never see him. Could never touch him. So, why he was... You, man... Why you, what? Mama, why we can't touch him? Because we're human. He made a goat? I don't know. i never seen God. But, um... Yeah, got lonely. So... God noticed that that her perfect little creation was sad and lonely no matter <gasps> what she tried to do to please him. So she decided to put herself in the flesh and make a woman. <laughs> I believe that's why women... Have the strength to boys do everything, and it's like the male. Ooh, a lot of men go get mad, but the male is the helpmate. Mm. What's wrong? Mm -hmm. <laughs> get out! No, 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 no. But yeah, I think the male was designed to be the helpmate, just like they was. That's why they was made first to be the helpmate of God. 
Because what if God was a male? What male, you know, put in the detail in designing anything and naming stuff and all that? No, nope, I don't know no man that does all of that. You go into a man apartment, he got the basic necessities. He got like a sofa. Stop doing that. That's hurt my ears. Um, he got like a sofa, a bed, and a TV, and a game system. That's it. He ain't got like no... If you go into a girl's apartment, she got curtains. She got pictures up on the wall. You know what I'm saying? Just decorating the whole house, make it look all cute and stuff. And the men are ugly. Oh my God. So that's why I feel like God is a woman. And she had the male to help her, just help her do stuff around the earth. As she designed it, had him name all the creatures and told him what to name them and all the other stuff. Good but morning. since he got lonely, she put basically herself in the flesh so that he wouldn't be lonely. But then here come her sister, jealous and mad because she and, kicked her and, out. And me. Yeah, me. And because me. she mad because she kicked her out of heaven. So I don't know why. she tempted Eve. Why? Why you want to get her sister out? Because she was being bad. Oh. Like, bad people? Mm-hmm. And then... That's why bad people follow the devil? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, Hooray! <laughs> this girl. But, um, Tempted Eve. People say she tempted her with an apple. But I think it's just a metaphor. Poison apple? No, not a poison apple. Just an apple? The tree of life. It's. I don't think we was designed to um, yeah, I, I procreate the way that we do now. I think because of sin, that is how we procreate and make life. I think we were supposed to manifest our children. That organ that's inside us that nobody knows what it's, what it's there for. What's the purpose of it being in there? It's just in there. Mm -hmm. I think that's what it was for. I think we were supposed mm -hmm. to manifest our children. Mm -hmm. But because of sin, we procreate and have our kids that way. Mama, what? I wish I had my one like this. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, so I think she showed her some things, some tricks. Like I said... Lucifer and God are entities so they can become whatever they want, male or female. It, it's no, they don't have like genders. So they can turn into whatever they need to be. And so I think at this time, Lucifer turned herself into a male and tempted Eve and showed her some things. <laughs> and then she went back and showed Adam them things. You know, she threw it back. Mm -hmm. Um, cause from, cause it's a, he a boy. Them like each other. Oh my gosh, I'm talking about Eve. Eve is a girl. So she went back, showed Adam, threw it back Adam on him. Adam is a boy. And little did she know, since it happened in the same day, she. Got pregnant twice. What? Once by Lucifer and once by Adam. End up having twins, Cain and Abel. Drum up, please. And Cain is the descendant of Lucifer, 
and Abel is through, you know, Adam and Eve. And that's why God favored Abel more. Um, Come up, please. <laughs> yeah, so, and, and because Cain is his daddy's child, he had that jealous spirit in him. Jealous of his brother because he wasn't a bastard child. I heard that. You wasn't supposed to hear that. I just said that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and... I'm probably go I'm probably go gag some other people. I believe Caucasian people are the descendants of Cain and we are the descendants of Abel. And that's why white people treat us so bad. Because and good ones treat us not bad. Yeah, I ain't go don't just make it seem like I just dislike white people. Cause that is not true. I love everybody. Yeah, not bad people. But it is a majority of white people that are do just... Do us bad. Yeah, that do us bad. And for no reason, good. just because we have um, chocolate skin. Ooh, chocolate skin. <laughs> chocolate. Oh my goodness, this mm -hmm. child. But what is the only reason why white people should hate us or have a reason to hate us? They don't have any reason. But the real reason is they want they have no culture. They have no history. And that's why they trying to that's why they go around stealing everybody history cuz they don't have none for the, themselves. And they they want to be a part of something. And, and black people are the original people. And good. So, not, so why not try to be a part of the original people? But the original people saw your real ways to kill, steal, and destroy. And sent you off into the Caucasus Mountains. Cavemen, that's their history. Cavemen is their history. But, no. No. you heard my leg. Never. And when they got out of them mountains, actually, we freed them from the mountains. And what we get in as a thanks, murder, stealing, killing, all that, raping. That's why we sent them up there in the beginning. Because they was doing all of that. Then we take them out. Teach them how to walk again. Because they walking around like animals. Teach them how to read and write. And they kill again. us all. Again. We and white again. Mm. Yeah. So I think that's the whole little beef. Between. Girls? No, black people and white people. It's jealousy. You say they want to be a part. A family. Cause the ones that don't be tripping, that's basically what I hear. I want to be a part of you guys. I want to be. I want to be down. Good. But instead of them Not down. Not just down. saying, well, just chilling. You know what I'm saying? And just being like, I just want to be cool. I don't want no beef. They don't know how to do that. So instead, they go about it the wrong way. About, like, being a bully. Trying to, you know, bully somebody into making you a part. When people would respect you and like you so much more if you just be yourself. Hmm. Just be yourself. Don't force nobody to love you or to like you. Don't bully nobody. Because 
you bully them, they still don't like you. <laughs> so what's the point of bullying somebody and to try to have you a part of? I know it can get lonely when you feel like the outcast. That's how a lot of people that don't think like normal people, the weird people, or whatever you want to call them. No, don't call them weird people. I, I know, but people call me weird all the time. <laughs> yeah. So, it's like, just because I don't think the way you think, you outcast me and make me feel like I'm this weird person that that's not deserving of, I don't know, friends or whatever. At the end of the day, everybody just want to be loved. Everybody want to feel a part of something. Family? Everybody want some family. I just say that. Yes, I was just reading ah! you. Malia, sit up. You hurt me. You heavy. Do you not understand you heavy? No. Yes, you heavy. You almost like 60 pounds, girl. Whoa, stop pounding me. <laughs> Look at pet. Oh, we need to chunk this mom's. No, you don't. Look how shiny her face is. If she didn't put on all that shea butter. So what's your thoughts? What's your beliefs? Did it make you angry with my beliefs? No. Could God really be a woman? Yes. I think so. Women are very powerful. Yeah. Very, very powerful. Not men. I think that's why society try their best to be little women. Because if we knew our power, it's be alive. We'll be we we just be out here dominating, ah. taking over. Yep, and the whole place. <laughs> and the whole place, as Beyonce say, "Who won the world?" Not me. <laughs> you supposed to say girls. Who run the world? Not me. No, you supposed to say girls. Girls, even yeah. anybody that play chess, it's girls. you know who is the strongest? Girls. The strongest uh, piece on the board? Girls. The queen. She can make moves that the king can't. She can take anybody out on the board with one swipe. The king, he can't make moves like that. She has to protect him or it's game over. We are the girls. <laughs> we are powerful creatures, us women. Hmm, not creatures. And I hope that some woman out there that's feeling weak that's feeling like she can't make it to tomorrow. Mama, what's this? That's my thread ripper. No, this. That wedding. I don't know. They just put it on there. I don't know what it's for exactly. But this is to rip the thread. Um, yeah. Woman that feel like she can't make it to tomorrow. That feel like... You need a man. Take you don't me. need a man. You need yourself. You need yourself. I just say that. <laughs> that was just a smart observation. I just I just wanted to repeat it.
That was so smart. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why do you always want to beat me? Okay, I won't repeat you. But yeah, you just need yourself. A man you is there. You said you're not going to beat me. Okay, that was the last time. A man is there to compliment you. And so whatever woman that you think you are, you, and powerful. you feel like you powerful. You are powerful, but if you don't know your power, I don't. I don't. You don't want to beat me. Okay, but if you don't know your power, and um, then you wonder why you got this man that you feel like is draining you and not getting you to the next level. Um, that's you don't. because. That's who you feel you are inside. And make you And happy. that's who God has sent you to compliment you. And make so you if you feel like you need more, you take yourself to the next level. And God will send that man that's on that next level to compliment you. And make you safe. And make you safe. And love you. Mom, I told you, you don't want to beat me. I'm not he clapping. will encourage you. He will be your helpmate. He help me too. Yep. Don't dare say <laughs> You are strong, and woman. You, and you're beautiful. And you're beautiful. And you're powerful. I break your fingers and stop keeping me <laughs> aside. You be the best woman you can be, and, and be, God will send you that man to compliment you, and make you in the happy. way that you need. And make you happy. Mm hmm If I repeat her, she go get mad and try to break my finger. You see her? <laughs> These little hands thinking she gonna break my finger. She is violent, y'all. I keep trying to tell y'all. I don't know where she get that from. She got a smart mouth and she violent. Where you get that from? I don't know either. I be trying to stimulate her brain, you know, encourage her to be a good girl. You a good girl? You sure? You positive? You intelligent? You a genius? Speak life into your children. Don't call them little effers and MFers and that little B. Don't do that. And then you wonder and 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 telling them they act just like their daddy. Like uh, Especially if their daddy no good. Like, and then you wonder why they like grow a bad up guy. and actually act like their daddy. Like you speak like life a, into them. Like you gonna be better than your daddy. Mm -hmm. You gonna be a genius. You and gonna do you, great things. Your daddy make mean stuff to you um you be sick. you tell your mom <laughs> yeah and kids if anybody is hurting you you tell somebody that you feel safe around that you feel like it's gonna do something about or it. you have a don't bad, keep it in or you have a bad Cause, daddy because it's damaging y'all you tell your mom you have a bad daddy Go to sleep. Take a nap. <laughs> now I'm gonna go die. Fuck this girl. Why? Cause you just gonna take a nap. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, that was our time. Bye bye. Guys. She just be ready to cut y'all out. Get out of here. Bye. She rude. <laughs> Don't put it here. Thank well, get you. off of me. Right. You in my lap telling me not to touch you. How that sound? Y'all, how do that sound? Somebody in your lap telling you not to touch them. I just drinking water. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> that's been our time. Bye. We talking beliefs Bye. today. What's your beliefs? Drop Bye. a comment. Bye. Thank Bye. you for Bye. stopping Bye. in. Bye. We at 18 subscribers. Woo woo. We growing, Malia. Bye. <laughs> Thank you.
y'all. We love y'all. Bye. We know y'all don't have to watch us, but we grateful that you do. Come back tomorrow for the next topic. Don't don't do it. Don't do it. We only got 10 days left, y'all. Our 30 days almost up. It, it went by quick. Hmm. No, it's not. It did go by quick. We only got 10 days left out of 30 days. I don't think she know how much 30 days is. <laughs> I no, I don't. Oh, my goodness. But we only got 10 days left. Bye-bye. So make sure you um Bye. continue to come back and see us for these next 10 days. Bye, girls. Bye. My fast ends Bye. October 26th. So I will be revealing um, how much weight that I've lost on the 26th. Um, I love baby and I dolls. also post a before and after picture on Facebook so y'all can see if there's any difference or change. Also... Hey, uh -oh. I'm going to stay in the house <laughs> until this fast ends. Hey, oh. We're not leaving the house because hey, every hurt. time I go to leave the house, hey, something hey. happens. Last time I left the house, I missed my package. And today, I tried to leave the house and lock myself out the house and had to call a locksmith. So, I'm just going to stay in the house. Until this fast is over, then that's when I'm going to go out the house and um, whatever I might need out the house. Like, uh -oh. go try to make some money. Uh -oh. oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel yeah. God is going to bless me with whatever I may need by the time this fast is over. So, after that. I think I'll be good to go outside. What you think? I got thumbs up. See y'all tomorrow. Bye.